get execution policy list now you see here it shows that running the script is disabled on this system and for more information uh, you you have to see the execution policies so if i talk about the execution policy in windows when you are running the script so you have to make sure the execution policy is not restricted so if i go here to shell i'll show you here get execution policy list you can see here that the scope uh, for the machine policy is undefined user policy is undefined process is undefined of course these will be defined in the group user policy but if you see here current user it is restricted and local machine is also restricted so i need to enable it for the process execution so instead of the get execution policy i'll be setting the user policy for process so i have provided you that also here if you see here execution policy unrestricted and scope is process so copy this command here and go back here to powershell and run this and it will ask for the confirmation i'll give the confirmation yes and now if i go back and run that script again here it will allow you do you want to run this i will run this and once i click r so it will start installing rust desk here using the script using the shell i'll again restrict the policy now here you can see here to restrict the policy again so i'll just go back here to the powershell and here i'll be typing and the execution policy for machine of course is uh, not required so i'll be doing it for process scope is process which i earlier enabled and yes now if i show you the get execution policy list you can see here everything is restricted process current user and local machine of course user policy and machine policy can be changed from the group user policy my system is also secure if you like this video hit the like button and don't forget to give me your feedback in the comment section below don't forget to join the channel